Welcome back. North Central Florida hunters may soon get the break they've been looking for. Members of the Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission will vote tomorrow on whether hunters can hunt using silencers. It's currently illegal to use a noise suppression device in Florida while hunting. TV20's Nico Clements tells us most hunters are all in on this, but that won't stop others from expressing concerns. Chapter Chair of the Florida Trail Association Mitchell Sapp says he's not against hunting or guns. But as for silencers, he says the idea for trail hikers like he and others is frightening. If he's over there shooting and you can hear it, you're going to turn around and walk the other way. But with a silencer on and he's trying to kill dew bucks standing in a row, I'm not going to hear that if he's got a silencer. Sapp says if a proposed amendment that would remove the ban on the use of noise suppressed or silencer equipped rifles and pistols for hunting is passed, this would affect a number of people. Well, besides the fact that a gun will make you aware that someone has got a dangerous weapon in their hands and they're shooting it. They may be shooting targets. They might be behind a barrier or a berm, and that's perfectly okay. But if I don't know that they're behind there, I'm going to shoot back. Silencers are only banned in 11 states. Here in Florida, they're illegal for hunting. Hunter Travis Guggenheimer says silencers wouldn't completely suppress the blast of a rifle, but it would benefit hunters in the future. A lot of people, older people, um, even from uh, back in the, the wartime, where now they can't hear, uh, they have a lot of hearing devices. Uh, hearing aids, anything to help them hear because of the of the blast of the rifle coming out. Now that first rifle I shot had no silencer. I was wearing earplugs. This one has a silencer, no earplugs. Hunters like Travis Guggenheimer tells me that with these noise suppressors, it will make hunting hearing safe. It will allow hunters to hunt without having the blast damage their hearing. Yes, definitely. If they pass it, I will be the first one to uh, use it. But first, FWC officials will vote on repealing the ban on Thursday. Nico Clements, TV20 News.